Hello everyone, I'm Reno Cabral at SystemRecipes.com. In today's video, I'm going to show you some basic configuration on Windows Server 2012. Things like how to change your server name and how to change your static IP address. Um, so to do that, if you go to your server manager, in server manager, if you just click on your local server, and in local server, you'll see your computer name so if you just click your computer name and by default Microsoft gives you some random names so you just click on change and enter your server name I'll put as server 1002 you can also add this Windows Server 2012 to a domain uh, but that's only possible if you have Active Directory and Directory Service installed. For now, I don't really have it installed. So in my next video, I'm going to show you how to install Active, Active Directory, Directory Services, and how to connect your server or any other computer to that domain. So for now, I'll just change the computer name and click OK. Click OK again. Click on Close. And it's going to ask you for a restart so just click on restart now so let's log in to check if your uh, the server name has changed let's go to server manager again click on local server and you see that the computer name has changed to server 2012 Let's minimize the server manager. In the bottom right corner, you'll see the network icon over there. So just right click that and click on Open Network and Sharing Center. On the left hand side, just click on Change Adapter Settings. Select the network card, right click it and click on Properties. In the Properties window, if you just go down to Internet Protocol version 4 that's TCP IPv4 and select click on properties in properties if you select by default you got obtain IP address automatically so if you just click on use the following IP address to assign a static IP address and enter your static IP address for me it's going to be 192.168 one dot two. Twenty-four. Uh, the subnet mask is two five five dot two five five dot two five five dot zero. My default gateway is one nine two dot one six eight dot one dot one. My DNS server is going to be the same server as I'm planning to install DNS on this server. So I'll just mention same IP address 2.168.1.2 and I'll click on OK click close so it's going to identify and assign the static IP address so let's close this let's close this to verify if your static IP address has been assigned you just click on the start tab and search for command prompt if you just type CMD if you select command prompt and in command prompt if you just type in IP config and hit enter over here you can see that IP version 4 address is 192.168.1.2 so the static IP address has been assigned. We close this. If you like this video, please make sure you click on the like button and please subscribe to my channel for some future videos. And thanks a lot for watching.